Now is the perfect time to join Tinder. Yes, this is a shower curtain. On Sunday, March 29th, Tinder recorded the highest number of swipes ever. With people self-isolating and lonely, now's the time to pounce. To succeed, I'm going to need gorgeous photographs, a witty profile, and the app. I'll get the app. Let's begin. Wow. I want three photos. One, a professional headshot. Luckily, I already have one. I had it taken in November. It's okay to have one old photograph, isn't it? Two. I want to wear a cool outfit on a stool. I don't know why, I just want it. Three, I want a candid photo in the kitchen. I want the audience to think, what is she drinking? Who took the photo? Can she cook? Let's apply some heavy makeup. This is the candid kitchen look. It screams I've been to a summer wedding and I love dresses with pockets. Which mug goes best with my dress? I think the blue too. Let's begin the photo shoot. Just casually sipping my mystery liquid. Put the handle on the other side. One hand it's sipping. Thinking and sipping. Laughing and sipping. <laughs> Candid kitchen photo shoot complete. Call me a tween, but I love dungarees. And this is as high as I can get my ponytail. If you can't tell, this is the cool outfit sat on a stool look. High side pony, check. Beautiful Latin shoes for people with a foot fetish? Check. Cool outfit? Check. Stool to sit on? Check. Quarantine weight? Check. Let's begin. Perched on the stool, walking around the stool, pondering life as a stool, holding dungaree strap, perched and thinking. Perched and thinking whilst pulling my dungaree strap. Perched and thinking whilst holding my ponytail. Now I need to get the app. The last time I had Tinder was in 2014. I only lasted on it for three days because it drove me crazy. I hated swiping. Okay, I can't get the app on my phone because firewall but I can access their website on my laptop because VPN. So now I'm going to fill in my profile. Okay, so I'm not going to use my full name because stalkers. I'm gonna use an abbreviation, Letty. Now please never call me that. This is for Tinder purposes only. Okay, I'm a woman, I've got an email address, I've got a birth date. I was born on 15th of July, send me a card. And I'm going to use the professional headshot as my photo. The other two photos are obviously flawless, but I need to edit them. Lovely, that looks great. All done. Okay, so now it's getting real. I've added the photos. Photo two, cool outfit sat on a stool with a little hint of foot for people with foot fetish. Photo three, Candid in the kitchen photo with a mystery liquid. Can she cook? Who took the photo? What is she drinking? Abbreviated name, my age. Oh my God, that's horrifying. I can't believe they put our age on this thing. Evil. And now I need to set my limits. What's that mean? I've got 12, what? 12 likes? Oh my God. This is exciting. I haven't even, huh? What? How does this work? Oh my god, oh my god, I'm dying. 
I want to fix my profile though. I want to tell them what I'm interested in and what I'm not interested in. Okay, maximum distance, not very far. Girl I ain't transferring her body anywhere for anyone. Um, so yeah, 40k, maybe less. I think 30. Like they have to be in Beijing and that's it. Looking for men, age range. Okay, it says 28 to 36. Um, yeah, I don't want to go younger than 28. 36, I don't know. How old is Chris Evans? Seriously. I want to be available to Chris Evans if he ever comes to Beijing. So let me just Google him. Chris Evans age. Now if you don't know who Chris Evans is, I'm not talking the ancient radio DJ. I'm talking Captain America. <gasps> He's 38. Okay, so let me check. 36, okay, I've got to roll this up to 38. But what if he has a birthday? Okay, 39. He might have a birthday this year, we don't know. Okay, show me on Tinder. Yes, show me on Tinder. What about the bio? Where do I write my bio? Now, when it comes to the bio, I don't actually know what I'm going to write. I've got a few options. One, I thought I could be confident. Swipe right on this and you win at life. Two, I thought I could be quizzical. Can you guess what I'm drinking in my blue mug? And finally, I thought I could be topical. Do you need some company during self-isolation? Okay, to be honest, none of those work. So please, please, please comment below this video with what I should write in my bio. Because right now, I'm just gonna leave it blank. I mean, it's working for me. I've already got 12 likes, uh, thank you. But please, write something, please. I. <laughs> Pretty please, I'm crossing my fingers that you write something. Write something down below in the comments. What can I say? If you know me, you can describe me. If you don't know me, or you've watched my vlogs, you can kind of guess what I'm like. Answer, amazing. But if you're not sure, just watch a few videos and you'll realize I am actually amazing. But please write something in the comments, please. Okay, so now let's go back. Let me see if I can find anything. It's like it's got its own language. It says things like manage read receipts. What's a read receipt? Who knows? Well, it looks like I can't do anything right now because I'm a dum-dum at this. So please subscribe to this channel. In one week, I will make a new video telling you the progress, which obviously is awesome, amazing, breaking the internet. But check back in one week, subscribe, and then you won't miss the video. I'm gonna tell you how many more likes I get because if I get 12 in 10 minutes, Imagine how many I'm gonna get in a week. Yeah, millions. I know, amazing, right? Thank you for watching this video. Bye! You thought this vlog was over, I thought this vlog was over, but I've realized how you do your bio. So I've got a temporary bio. I'm gonna run it past you, give me your feedback. Not too much cleavage. I like to keep busy doing fun activities like attending dance classes visiting cat cafes and browsing museums. Would you swipe right on that? I mean, yeah, hello, amazing, oh my God. I put my job, I put my job title down as teacher. I didn't say English teacher because I don't want to be teaching anyone, no English, I just put teacher. Not gonna put my company, not gonna put my uni. I will add my city, Beijing, if it lets me, but it's been a pre pretty crappy app. And uh, yeah, so now I know how to do that, that's great. But I still want you to write your comment below, okay?